Hey, what's going on, guys? Hey, it's back here with another video, and it's another story time. I'm gonna try and do these once a week, like I said. So this one's when I went to Toronto. So I went to the CN Tower and Ravens Graham. I'll talk to the CN Tower first. So like I was sitting like on the benches like below the CN Tower, like kind of near like Rogers Place, I think it's called, or like Rogers Stadium or something. Well, I know where it's where the Blue Jays play, and like. I had my dad's sunglasses on because it was, like, a really, really sunny day. And I'm looking at the tower. It's, like, moving. So, like, my first time, I'm like, I'm not going up there. Knowing my luck, it's probably going to fall over or something. But, no, I went up there. But, for some reason, it was, like, a really, really, really busy day. We're, like, waiting for, like, four hours to go in the tower. Like, it's at the point where they have to bring entertainment out to freaking, like, entertain the fucking crowd. Like, it was, I don't even know. It was, like, so cringy. He was actually really good at tricks, though. So, we're waiting in line for, like, four hours. Oh, yeah, my dad also won, like, a game or something that they played in there. Oh, yeah, and this was two summers ago. This was, like, nothing when, like, COVID was happening. This wasn't, like, last summer. It was summer before. So, yeah, obviously not in COVID. So, I'm, like, so, like, we're about to go in the elevator, right? And I'm, like, so scared because I'm, like, super scared of heights if you know me well. So, like, we're going up. Like, we're going up. I'm, like, down on the ground. Like, I don't even know what I was doing because you could, like, see the whole city and I was so scared. And then, like, my eardrums just popped because, like, we were going so high up in the air. And if you know, if you go high up in the air, your eardrums pop. For some reason, I don't know why they told us why, but I forget. It's, like, two years ago. <laughs> so then we get up on the tower. Like, I'm scared. Like, I'm not even going to look out. They had, like, this glass, like, floor, and I wasn't even going to step on it. Knowing my luck, like I said, it's probably going to break or something. But then, so then we're up there for, like, 15 minutes, and we waited, like, for four hours. Oh, my God, it was brutal. <laughs> and then, like, um, we had fries there, and all I remember is that they were super hot. It's not really, like, connected to the story, but, yeah. <laughs> so then... We go to Ripley's Aquarium, because like, just near the CN Tower. Pretty sure it's, like, next door to it or something. Oh, I can also tell you guys uh, when I went to the taco place there, but that will be after this, because it was after this. So, I walk into Ripley's Aquarium. It's, like, a fish wonderland. Like, oh, my God, it was, like, so cool when I walked in. And I'm just going to, just a disclaimer, I don't really remember much about um, um Ripley's Aquarium, but I'll try and remember. So, I remember, like, you can go in, like, this one tunnel thing. And, like, there was so much fish in swim over here. It was cool. And, it, oh, it was so cool. And, uh, like, we were paying the stingrays. Like, you guys aren't going to believe me on this, but trust me, it's true. We were, like, paying the stingrays. Like, because, like, if you don't touch the bottom, they don't sting you. And then this baby hammerhead shark comes and tries to bite my stepmom, Jen. And, like, she moves her hand out of the way. Like, trust me, this is real. Like, I'm not lying. But then, yeah, we did a bunch more stuff, then we left. So then, um, we're at this, uh, taco place. I forget what it's called. Like, I know that it's, like, a franchise, but, like, I forget what it's called. But anyway, so, like, it was in Toronto. And, like, there was this, like, a Mexican lady. And she, for some reason, she couldn't, well, like, I know why she couldn't really understand me. But I was, like, talking. She's like, what's you at? Like, and I was, like, talking, and I'm like... I want this, and then she like, oh my god, I don't know why, but like, it's, it kind of got a little bit annoying, like she kept like, and then I, like it was at the point where she's yelling at me, and I'm like, I don't know what you want me to say, like, I just want a meat and cheese taco, because that's all I get, then yeah, we leave, Toronto, that was my trip to Toronto, yay, hope you guys like this one, and See you all next week when I make another story time. Bye.